Hey everybody and welcome to the channel. So, uh, little news. <laughs> I I forgot to make my my BoxyCharm by Ipsy paid for video live. Um, so this is the PR for January, okay, for the BoxyCharm by Ipsy. And if we have time, I will also be unbagging the Ipsy Glam Bag for January. And then in a couple days, I will make my um, December <laughs> box live. <laughs> So just just ignore the fact we're a little out of order but you know it's that week after Christmas before the New Year's I feel like everybody gets a little scatterbrained so you know it's okay right anyways hello and welcome to the channel my name is Rhonda I talk a lot and we're here to have a good fun time for a long time by keeping it cute or putting it on mute in this judgment free drama free stress free zone uh, so like I said this is the PR or what Ipsy did gift to me so I did not make any pics or anything like that a matter of fact when it comes to BoxyCharm by Ipsy it's like the first of the month that you get to go into your account and make your picks so be ready for that for January so crazy I feel like 2023 just flew by I do want to give a big shout out and thank you to dossier for partnering with me in today's video if you don't if you've never heard of dossier you all dossier is a great way to pick up perfumes and clones and unisex scents without breaking the bank if you love bougie bougie perfumes and clones but you don't like spending an arm and a leg and a left kidney well guess what dossier is for you i've been talking about them for years they let me pick out three new perfumes to add to my collection and i love them i've talked about in the past some of the scents that they offer that are inspired by such as like the versace bright crystal love that scent they have a perfume for that if you love the victor and roth flower bomb they also have that scent starting as low as 20 dollars and the more you purchase the more you save code Rhonda 5 will save you off your purchase over at dossier as well so they did let me pick out some new perfumes uh, the first one is woody chestnut now this is actually inspired by replica by the fireplace can I just tell you guys this has this beautiful sweet but yet woodsy fire scent I love it. I just think it smells so nice. And if you guys have ever priced replica, like, mm -hmm. so that's what's really nice about Dossier is like, if you're not really in the mood to drop 150 to 160 plus dollars on a perfume, they have you. So if you are loving like a little Juliet has a gun, uh, they have that. They have the YSL. They have the, is it called Killians? They have so many. I'm going to have a link down below. Definitely make sure to check them out. Another one that I did pick out is Green Fig. This one is definitely really different than my typical fragrances, but I love it. It's got like a natural, clean, floral, but like not too flowery type of vibe to it. It's actually inspired by Byredo, I think is how you say it. I know that's a really bougie perfume as well. And I know I hear so many people talk about it, but Green Fig smells so good. And I almost feel like, in all honesty, mixing together Woody Chestnut and Green Fig would smell really nice together. Like I was playing around before I started filming, spraying the cards. And I love the mixture of them together. Now, the nice thing with Dossier is you get to try it out. So you have 30 days to actually try out the perfumes, the clones, the unisex scents. And if it doesn't for some reason work with your body oils, your chemistry, what have you, you can go ahead and return it. No worries whatsoever. And like I said, they start off at $29. They also sent over another one that I picked out. And this is what it's going to look like. You've got a nice little box. Great for gifting. We got Valentine's there's always things coming up uh, this is inspired by the Tom Ford tobacco vanilla perfume and this is called powdery tobacco so this I love Tom Ford's perfume I have like the a little sample I think it's called like wild, wild cherry or something like that I can't remember but I do know that dossier actually has an inspired by perfume for that one 
This one smells really good too. Honestly, mixing all three of these together would smell really, really good. I just feel like you can't go wrong when it comes to Dossier. Their scents last and they're just a nice luxury type of fragrance without the luxury price tag. Thank you once again to Dossier for partnering with your girl in today's video. Don't forget, Rhonda 5 will save you that additional 5% at checkout, and they're definitely worth checking out. I know my mom loves them. I have my kids wearing them. I mean, it is a great way to grow your fragrance collection without having to worry about feeling a little guilty later. And I always love the fact they have a magnetic closure so if you're like me and you chuck things in your bag your purse your overnight bag whatever you don't have to worry about things spilling and all of that so anyways make sure to check my link down below and let's go ahead and jump into our let's start off with our boxy charm by ipsy there's no foam get a little nervous when i see palettes in here and there's no foam all right, so the BoxyCharm by Ipsy, I think is running about $35 now. You do get to customize three out of the five products and the other two items Ipsy does pick out. Let's go ahead and just jump in before I show everything else. So this is the Seraphine Botanicals Geranium Plus Glow Blush and Highlight Palette. Now, this is a brand that we've seen in Ipsy for a hot doggone minute, to be honest with you. And some of this stuff is really, Good. There was like a cream blusher palette that we received a while back. So you got four shades in here. It looks like this is the actual highlighter. You've got two like matte blushers and then this one is more of like a shimmer topper or type of blush. So this is what it looks like. It does have a mirror and it's pretty. No scent. <laughs> I just got spoiled with all the dossier scents. It smells so freaking good in here, like between all three of those perfumes. Okay, next in here, this has me very excited. The Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Niacinamide Sunscreen. Um, maybe I'm a little late to the game, but I had no idea that Glow Recipe had a sunscreen. You guys are probably like, duh, Rhonda. Okay. All right, so this is a SPF 50. This makes me happy. I don't care whatever the season is. I always, always have sunscreen on. Okay, there is a nice little scent. And, oh, that's pretty. Okay, so it doesn't look like there's like a white cast. You just have like a nice glisten. I like that. I like that a lot. This makes me happy. This is one of those products that I could definitely see potentially picking up in the, I don't know what they even call it anymore, add-ons. Okay, next in here we have LYS Beauty. Uh, this is a mascara. I did not know they had a mascara. See, that is the nice thing about subscription boxes is you learn about brands, you learn about new products that they've come out with. Lash Confidence. Please be a brush that I like because I really like LYS. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like a fluffier kind of brush that I feel like is actually going to really grip your lashes. I know it's weird that I'm doing this. It's okay. Okay, so here's one thing that I like. It didn't feel crunchy with the mascara that I already have on. And I really like that I feel like this brush kind of like really hugs and grips my lashes. Don't ask me why I smell things, okay? So um, I think this could be promising. I, I mean, I really love the contour. The, the foundation is good, good and hydrating. The concealer is good too. Next, we have the Farrah Smooth Focus Face Primer. I'll tell you what, my face primer go-to right now, surprisingly enough, considering I have extremely nice and dry skin, um, it's been the one size. I've been putting that right in my T-zone. And the Milk Makeup, it's like a matte poreless primer. I know it's really crazy uh, so I'll be kind of curious to try this one and see if it's this uh, looks like it's definitely more of a silicone base maybe too it feels like wet to the touch it's kind of weird dries down fairly fast I mean there's really nothing to see here Rhonda it's just a primer okay well and next in here we have the squalene facial oil by feel I mean I will say it, there's really nothing to show there either. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about it. Um, honestly, I'm most excited about these two products. Okay, here's the thing. I don't know 
what the picks are going to be but if i get picks like if i get to choose between these products i am definitely going to be picking these two things for sure and hopefully the other choices here's the thing there's no like spoilers anymore which has kind of got me bummed out i really wish that we could like do the little sneaky peekies like joe used to do i think that would be really cool so you kind of don't know what to expect come the first and i would love to get the sneaky peekies and get the excitement going again but anyways i would definitely be picking up these two if these were my choices that i got to pick for my box for january let's jump in real quick to the glam bag now this has gone up to like $17 a month. You do get to customize one item in the bag. Oh, the bag is really cute. I love, you guys know, sparkle, glitter, and all things shimmer, yes please. Um, but with this bag, it's typically more deluxe size samples, which is fine. I, I don't mind that whatsoever. Still gives you a chance to figure out if you like something or not. Um, so the first thing in here is by Daydreams. It's an eyeshadow palette kind of nice okay so we've got a nice plastic pink packaging oh that's pretty i'm gonna just go ahead and probably gift this but i will say i do think the color story is pretty looks like we have a pressed glitter right there in the center but i definitely feel like i probably already have this so i'd rather just give it to someone who will use it and love it and all of that um, I really love this bag though. Like look how pretty this bag is. That is so like New Year's. When I think of New Year's, I think of sparkle. Okay, this is the Lauren's Vanilla Almond Body Lotion. Yes, please. Love when I get things like that. Next in here, we've got the YC Collection. This is the Island Eyeliner. What shade is this? I Like I'm excited thinking it's going to be green. Is it? <gasps> no, it's a fun purple though. And I just did it over top of that primer and it really was nice and glidey. Let's see if it is. Oh, it's just a gel. It's it's just a glidey. I honestly, this may, I think this may work with my blue eyes. I feel like I have to be careful with like plums. I know some people will be like, oh no, no, no. Plums are great with blue eyes. Mine are like more blue gray. And I'm like, um, is it though? I kind of feel like it, it, it accentuates the fact that I didn't really get good sleep last night. Bloodshot eyes, you know, definitely got to make sure to use my eye drops. Oh, okay this okay here here let me tell you something y'all so the primer really makes things stick because i can rub this side off i mean it yeah this primer this is a good primer all right next in here we've got oh okay this is first day beauty i love first day beauty y'all know that and this is a deep cleanser with red clay helps to remove excess oil and unclog pores so probably something really good for oily skin people um that is not my journey i no longer have oily skin i would almost Keeps you young, keeps you fresh. Uh, next in here we have the Verify, which I learned last month when Haley and I did an unbagging. Um, this is a 2020 eye cream. Uh, you guys actually told me this brand is insanely amazing and you are excited to see it come to Ipsy. So I'm excited to try that out. Right now I've been loving the Kiehl's Avocado Eye Cream. If you guys are looking for a really good hydrating eye cream, I would definitely recommend the Kiehl's, um, but I digress. So that is everything and honestly low-key I'm a little bit more excited over the glam bag than I am my boxy charm. Let me know what do you guys think? What do you guys think overall about the brands we're seeing? I will say the brands that I'm seeing over here have me a bit more excited than what I'm seeing in the boxy charm one, which I really want I want a papal. You know what I mean? Like, even if your girl's tired, I want to unbox and be like, wow. And for $17, you did get a full-size palette. And the bag is really cute. I'm really excited about the glam bag.
it's little things i guess anyways let me know down below your thoughts if you do want to sign up for ipsy i do have an affiliate link and so thank you if you do decide to use that i definitely appreciate it thank you to ipsy for sending these boxes over for me to unbox for you guys let me know your thoughts are you guys wanting to see more like sneak peek spoilers of ipsy like we used to have because i really would love to start seeing that or doing that again getting excited about like the whole choice days and all of that shout out and thank you once again to dossier for partnering with your girl in today's video definitely make sure to check my link out down below and don't forget ronda five is gonna save you an additional five percent and with valentine's day just around the corner it's always great to stock up not only for yourself but for your man or your girl if your teen is starting to get into perfumes and everything or clones but you don't want to spend an arm and a leg and a left kidney start growing their collection this way too so anyways like i said dossier is always adding to their collection so i guarantee you there's going to be something for everyone and with the 30 day money back no questions asked policy you really just can't beat it so anyways all information is going to be down in my description box i want to give a big shout out and thank you to my youtube members for helping to support the channel you don't have to but you choose to and i appreciate you all thank you to those of you clicking the thanks button and tipping and donating to the channel don't forget to check me out on my other channels hot miss mama vlogs for curvy girl fashion hauls over there hot mess in the kitchen and of course definitely make sure to check out unconditional hot mess podcast Haley and i have started a podcast and we are super excited and you guys the first podcast that went up you guys were just super super kind you can find us on spotify as well i'll have all that information linked down below for y'all but anyways until next time i hope everybody has a safe new year's and don't forget the first of the month is when you make your choices your girl has rambled I'm hopping off. Until next time, kisses from Kentucky. Bye. I know about tomorrow. I don't want to fight no more. Cause I don't feel the need no more. No. Just want to make it stop.